Listen to this story carefully because at the end of it, the way you look at the dead will change forever. Now, spoilers alert. Now, there's a high chance that you have been associated with a bad kind of debt. Now, I know you might be wondering, there is more than one kind of debt and it is alarming that you're friends with wrong kind. Now, the answer is yes and yes. Today's video is all about how to change that and how to make not just money, but even debt work for you. Let me share with you the story of Gaurav who followed a traditional life, you know, this path till his mid thirties. He completed his graduation from a good university and then started working. Soon he began earning a decent income. Now this is where he became friends with a deadly enemy debt. He began getting calls from loans or credit cards. Initially, Gaurav ignored it, but Seeing the hi-fi life of people on social media and the pressure to maintain a social status, he too was caught in the debt trap. Now, there's a reason why I'm calling this debt a deadly friend. But more than that, later, he signed up for a credit card. Soon, daily necessities were replaced with desires and he, he did what most people do, you know, started swiping credit cards, you know, the pile, the debt started to rise and it was hard to notice that the monthly charges felt small. A life of luxury became his second nature. One BHK apartment was no longer enough. He moved into his two bedroom home apartment, you know, rented it out. He was there when society and peer pressure attacked him the second time. It is that time when everyone around you is interested in hearing your wedding bells. Remember that time? And that's what happened. Now, he got married, right? And now that he is married, Gaurav wanted to have a place of his own. A big three bedroom home in the best neighborhood, right? So enter the home loan. Just like many people, Gaurav also considered home as an asset. The EMIs were bigger than ever. One thing led to another, home loans, car loans, vacations, huge credit card bills, everything started to pile up. Now Gaurav began to notice all his debt was doing was taking the money out of his pocket. Plus, a lack of financial education or knowledge meant no budget and no real understanding of cash flow and the assets and liabilities. Burdened by the debt and cluelessness about what to do next, it was his moment that he saw a brochure for Financial Freedom Workshop. It became his biggest blessing as he got introduced to the antidote to this deadly enemy debt. Surprisingly, it was debt. Yes, debt was the cure for the debt, meaning lohe ko loha kaatta hai, right? How? Well, he found that there was another form of debt which was good debt. A debt that puts money in your account, money in your pocket. He began making the changes immediately. His big three bedroom home became a rental Airbnb. He sold his fancy car and an exchange bought five hashbacks on loan. Notice how the debt is still there, but how it was still good one. It is easy to convert those cars into taxi service. Now money started coming in. Soon, the rent and the taxis not only covered the EMI cost, but also started making money for him. It took Gaurav 35 years to learn this underrated yet valuable lesson of good debt versus bad debt. And Gaurav never looked back after. Today, his life is beyond everyone's dreams. That one lesson made him quit the traditional mindset and start financial education journey. He went on to invest in his skills and self-development instead of just a degree. His skills made him a great speaker, an excellent businessman, and a high ticket closer. That's how he managed to turn his whole life around. His only regret not attending that financial workshop when he was in college. Now, I hope this story helped you too understand the, the true meaning of debt. Let me share a bit more now on how good debt can fuel your financial dreams. All right, 
So, good debt, your secret is for financial freedom. Now, the good debt has many benefits like number one, good strategic move. It comes with many benefits. For example, using your credit card just for your essentials will save you money and increase your civil score. Next one, frees up cash flow. When you use the good debt wisely, it can free up your money. This can help you increase your passive income. Number three, it opens up the door for better and easier access to loans in the future. And number four, it also reduces financial stress. For example, if you buy a car on EMI and turn it into a taxi like Zoom car, Ola or Uber, so on and so forth, you're not only just creating an extra source of income, you don't have to worry about the EMI too. Now, good debt can be your biggest stepping stone towards financial success. But before we end this video, there's still a little bit more I want to share with you about bad debts. Now, it's important to understand the consequences of it. The dark side of bad debts. You know, the bad debt can quickly become your worst nightmare. Here's why. Number one, sky high interest rates. Even though you might feel like EMIs are low, but over the years, when you look at the interest that gets accumulated, it will leave you speechless. Number two, more defaults lead to a worsening of civil rating. If you miss even one payment, your rating takes the hit, making it more difficult for you to get loans easier later. Number three, not to mention, you end up paying huge penalties that keep adding up every day. In short, debt, if not used wisely, can wipe out the business, your life, and make you bankrupt. It is crucial to recognize the risk of bad debts and take protective steps to eliminate them. What are the strategies to avoid the bad debts and avoid them trap, right? Number one, create the budget. Now start tracking your expenses, create the realistic budget, like identify areas where you are, you know, you're, you're stuck or you cut back on unnecessary expenses. Now allocate more money towards your debt repayments. Number two, prioritize debt payments. Make a plan to pay off your high interest debts first. Like for example, credit card debts are the highest interest rates or personal loans are highest interest rate. So for credit card, make full payments and don't just pay the minimum amount because then the recurring interest will keep growing bigger and bigger, bigger. Number three, negotiate with creditors. Now reach out to all your creditors and try to negotiate the lower interest rate. And to your surprise, you'll be shocked how people are okay to change the terms and get the favorable repayment terms. Number four, explore debt consolidation. Now, what are the options? Now, consolidating high interest debts into single lower interest rate loan can simplify payments and potentially save on interest costs. So research different options and choose the one that fits your needs. Here's the conclusion. So here you go. So now you know the debt can help you fast track your way to financial freedom and which, which debt can slow you down. So take charge of your finances, create a budget, prioritize your debt payments, right? Negotiate with creditors and explore debt consolidation options. Remember, it's never too late to start and every small step towards debt elimination counts. Your financial freedom is within reach and with determination, discipline and right strategies, you can reach it in no time, right? So there you go. If you enjoyed this video, Give me a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and I will continue to share more educational content about finances, business, marketing, how to start the business, how to scale the business. So make sure you subscribe to this. And if you like this video, share it with your brothers and sisters and help them get educated about good debt and bad debt. See, a lot of people take good debt to buy the home and the home is paying itself, right? All the EMIs and everything. And then eventually you have the assets. So these simple strategies can be a game changer, okay? This is Dave Garvey. I'll see you in the next video. Take care. God bless you. Now, if you are really, really serious about learning more about business, case studies are good. It'll get inspiration, give me motivation. But you know what? Ideally, join some workshops, some physical events where you can learn the most. Now, if you're really looking to learn from me and other great legends like Robert Kiyosaki, you know, other amazing people, right? Uh, Aman Gupta from Boat, right? 
there is an event which is happening which is organized by Sneha Desai and Sunil Dosiani, amazing people and we'll have Robert Allen, we'll have DSR, I will be speaking there. It's all about growth and how do you create wealth, how do you create money and how do you grow your business and life. Do not miss this opportunity. Where else would you get an opportunity to listen to these legends and amazing speakers and mentors who have been there and done it. They're not just the teachers, they're practitioners. So check out the link. Do not miss this event, right? Check out whatever seat is appropriate. Now try, my advice is get into the best seat and try and spend as much time as you can with these amazing people, especially diamond people. You can come and say hello to me and we can spend time together. You know, you can get photo and dinner with Robert Kiyosaki. Man, Paisa Wasul, go and grab the diamond or diamond light. You will love it. This is going to be the best investment of your life, right? This is Dave Gadvi. I'll see you there.